I came across this opponent in head to head while I was recording for the Jiru video. The guy had a decent team but important of all his gameplay was amazing. Now as some of you guys might know I was using a TOTY squad for that challenge and my team was obviously weaker than his but this match was a classic example of how anticipation and experience improves our defending. This video is a tutorial on interceptions and shot blocking. Yeah, after all the above dialogues, I did manage to lose the match, but beginners will learn a lot about pro defending from this match. So, let me walk you through the match. As you can see he obviously had higher over and cups than me and I didn't even have proper center backs which is a big red flag in FIFA mobile but still I was more concerned about the fact that his players are stronger and faster than me. I knew speed was his biggest advantage and my players won't catch Eusebio's trigger run. So instead of chasing Eusebio I went in between them for the interception. The trick can be used in these situations as well but timing is very important. Your opponent must not get enough time to change the direction of the pass or even predict that you are anticipating a pass like that. I initially made a mistake dragging Brozovic towards Richardson but I recovered with this block with a quick switch of defenders. I just anticipated the shot and dragged my defender in the line of the shot. I practiced this a lot but it's very difficult to execute especially against curve shots but this block felt good. The danger was still there as Mbappe had the ball I had to do a slight tackle but they somehow managed to get the ball back I did another tackle and this time I passed it behind. In this kind of situations actually building up from behind helps a little bit uh, you know to calm down your nerves maybe. And I did manage to make a few more interceptions and blocks predicting the line of the pass just like I did previously. But trigger run from Eusebio was too good for me and I couldn't uh, catch him. I agree I could have done better there but I, I failed to notice the trigger run. Amrabat came up with another block. I was expecting a shot from Eusebio so I did second defense to put pressure. But he decided to throw pass which was eventually intercepted. And then the no nonsense defending from Brozovic. I did lose the match but I was happy as I did quite a few things right in this match and as I always say try to learn from your mistakes and irrespective of the result this match gave me lots of confidence and before ending I want to say one thing the more you play better you get.